Paul. Skeet is a shooting sport that has been around for more than 75 years and has meant a great deal to me and many other shooting enthusiasts. This exciting game was developed in the 1920s by a group of upland game hunters looking for a way to sharpen their wing shooting skills. The original game, called Shooting Around the Clock, was played on a circular field with stations placed around the circle. The trap was positioned at 12 o'clock with targets thrown to 6 o'clock. In the interest of safety, the shooting field was changed to a semicircle, with traps placed in a high house on the left side of the field and a low house on the right side of the field. There are seven stations placed around the semicircle, with station one starting at the high house and station seven at the low. An eighth station positioned in the center of the field and between the traps. Targets from both houses have a common crossing point in the center of the field and between the traps. In this new configuration, shooters were still presented with targets at every angle one would encounter in the field. Skeet is the only shooting game that provides all these angles in such a confined area. A round of Skeet consists of 25 shots, or one box of shotgun ammunition. Single targets are presented at each station from both the high house and the low house with double targets released simultaneously from both houses on stations one, two, six, and seven, making 24 shots. An option shot, or 25th target, is shot following a shooter's first miss in a round. If no misses have been recorded, the shooter takes an additional shot at the low house on station eight. In competition, most tournaments are scheduled for 100 targets, or four rounds of regular skeet. There are events for doubles or simultaneous pairs as well. In most instances, 50 true pairs of targets makes up the doubles event. As in traps, most skeet shooting is done for recreational enjoyment. When shooting for fun, any shotgun gauge can be used, but in competition, there are specific events for the 12, the 20, the 28, and 410 gauge guns. Since most shots are taken at about 20 yards, the majority of shotgunners prefer to use guns with more open chokes, such as skeet or improved cylinders. These chokes provide a wider shot pattern to compensate for the close target distances. As in any other shooting disciplines, skeet shooting presents no physical or gender barriers, so anyone who wants to play can do so. The game is truly a family sport, that can be enjoyed for years to come. Of course, there are various ways that a shooter can involve himself in the sport. He can simply enjoy skeet shooting for the recreational enjoyment it provides, or he can get involved in a competitive side of shooting at a local, state, national, or world level. In fact, American shooters have distinguished themselves many times with gold, silver, and bronze medals in numerous Olympic games. Perhaps one of the best aspects of skeet is that it doesn't take a long time to shoot around. In fact, a full squad of five shooters can complete a round of 25 targets in about 20 minutes. You and a friend could easily visit your local gun club, shoot a couple of rounds, and still have time for lunch. Another exciting aspect of skeet shooting is its social quality. Many friendships have been made and nurtured over the years because of this shooting game. And because of the social quality of the sport, it has also proven to be an excellent way for various organizations to hold charity fundraisers, much like they do in other participation sports, like golf, running, or tennis. Skeet shooting in America is governed by the National Skeet Shooting Association, headquartered in San Antonio, Texas. Today, the NSSA has more than 17,000 active members who enjoy skeet shooting on a regular basis. I started shooting skeet with my dad when I was 11. The game has provided me and my family with many pleasures and memories. And as a result of the game, I have made many lifelong friends. So give skeet a try. I'm sure that it will provide you with the same thrills and excitement that it has given me over the years.